Hey, good afternoon everyone, Trackman 44 here. This is a project that I had to work on uh, so long that I spent a lot of time thinking about. These are those sliding barn doors, these homemade sliding barn doors that I finally got installed. Uh, there were so much critical, uh, so many critical measurements that just had to be absolutely perfect. But at any rate, finally got down here today and got them installed. But everything about this project has been so difficult, I did not even take the time to put up the camera because there's so much downtime, I would have had to edit almost everything out anyway. So you're just going to get to see the end results. But at any rate, this is the trim board up at the top. You can see there's a little bit of a different color in the walnut up there and also on, the, uh, on this por portion right here that ties the doors together. And, but they are cut from the same time that we cut those original uh, walnut boards. But they've been bleached out, I guess, apparently by the sun or just by, uh, for whatever reason. But then again, this is all brushed on polyurethane and those are sprayed on polyurethane. I think that has an effect on it. But at any rate, that's what, uh, that's what I've been working on. So uh, there's the end result. And I think my daughter, or I hope my daughter is going to be happy with them. Up inside here is that, that heavy track that I showed you that I made with that Unistrut and then the, the sheet of, uh, or that uh, two and a half inch or three inch, whatever it was, by quarter inch plate. That's drilled for all the studs and everything, you know, so it's got a good secure backing. And over here above my head is that flange that screws into those headers up there. It's good and uh, sturdy. It's very, very stout. And these doors definitely, uh, they, they're definitely heavy. Um, I think a standard solid core door uh, is going to weigh about 82 pounds, and these are much bigger and um, much more heavy than that. They're going to go about 95 pounds a piece, as close as I can tell. Extremely uncomfortable for me to carry, and definitely a bit on the difficult side to install. That's that five and a quarter inch trim that I told you I was going to put up there to hide all of the rollers and everything. It goes all the way over to the wall, and then there's a there's a a bump stop that goes all the way down to the floor, of course, that the door is actually going to bump up to. Now I've still got to install the uh, the heavy cast iron barn door handles off of our other great grandfather's old barn door. They're cast iron. I still got to sandblast those and finish those down. So uh, that'll put the finishing touches on it for sure. So, at any rate, hope y'all enjoyed that. And uh, this is Trackman Forty Four, and I'm out of here, guys.